Hello everyone! Welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we will talk about Max Horkheimer as our first critical theorist of international relations. Max Horkheimer has been highly influential in the fields of political science and international relations with his ideas that shaped the critical theory to a great extent. He was among the leaders of the Frankfurt School, a school of social theory associated with the Institute for Social Research at Goethe University during interwar period. It is argued that his writings, especially from the 1930s, shaped the epistemological and methodological orientation of the critical theory of the Frankfurt School. Horkheimer aimed to integrate Marxist-oriented historical philosophy with the social sciences such as economics, history, and psychology. Today we know his approach by the name of critical theory. What Horkheimer argued was about the ineffectivity of the traditional approaches to describe social institutions. These approaches described the social institutions as they are and that resulted in legitimizing repressive social practices to a great extent. As a response, Horkheimer and his critical theory exposed these falsely claimed legitimacies because the theory is able to understand and explain a larger historical and social context which gives it the most significant cutting edge among other theories. Horkheimer questioned the possibility of society being more and more dependent on social institutions for functioning of the social life in a just and free manner. For him, only the institutions were not enough to transform the society as a whole. One needed to examine the entire material deeply in order to reach that aim. Only this way and being a rationally organized entity, a society could regulate its own existence and in the end resist repressive movements such as fascism. But overall, Horkheimer and his critical theory aimed to develop a critique of all social practices. So that brings us to the end of this extremely short video about Max Horkheimer. We will continue with Theodor Adorno as another key representative of the critical theory in our next video. If you like this video, please do not forget to like it and for our upcoming videos, please subscribe to our channel. Thank you very much for watching. We'll see you next time.